The ghost thief's eyebrows shot upward. What? You can see me, he exclaimed. Of course I can, you idiot, he whispered. Now get away from me. Shoo! Hey, lads, this one can see me. Can you see them too, eh? I can see all of you, Jake said impatiently, keeping his voice low to avoid waking the other boys. Easing up out of his smelly, bedbug-ridden cot, he stood and crept past the sleeping prisoners, followed by the ghost thief. I don't understand. Are you a ghost too, then? Not yet, Jake muttered. Then how come you can see us? I don't know. I just can, he whispered in annoyance. Explain yourself, lad. You got the second sight? The pirate captain demanded, clomping over to them on his peg leg. The two gentlemen duelists now noticed their conversation and stopped trying to run each other through, coming over to investigate as well. What is uh, going on here? Is it true, lad, you can see us? Jake scowled. Afraid so? Young master, the tall one said at once with a gentlemanly bow as he smoothed his fine ruffled shirt. Since you find yourself with the good fortune of being amongst the living, will you be so kind as to bring a message to milady? She's my lady. She loves me, his enemy interrupted, drawing his sword on him again. On guard! Never mind these two. They, they've been at this for a hundred years. Uh, the important question is, how do we get out of here? How should I know, Jake retorted. I'm trying to get out myself. If you'll excuse me... He marched past them, walking through one who refused to get out of his way. He went to the metal bars and peered through them, and focused his full attention on those tantalizing keys. With an enchanting cast, a wide range of fantastical settings, and a thrilling journey balanced by humor and friendship, The Griffin Chronicles is a magical series for the whole family. Discover the rollicking wit, pulse-pounding adventure, and heart-tugging emotion of the Griffin Chronicles today.